Retriever live in the heart of game. <laughs> the Shadow Snows. Hi, I'm the Shadow Snows and I'm back with another Let's Compare video. Tonight I compare the game Kickstart 2 on the Commodore 64, the Amstrad CPC and the Commodore Amiga. And I'll start with the Commodore 64. And this is a lot easier. And the graphics uh, looks a lot nicer than the first Kickstart. It just looks and feels a little more polished. And the speedometer helps a lot uh, to get the right speed uh, at the right obstacle. Okay, I was too fast. Well, as you can see, it's a lot easier than uh, Kickstart 1. And the music gets very annoying very quickly. But the game is, is awesome. Very good controls, oh that was close. Wow, that was a great round. So this game is really fun. Oh. And at least for the first level, it's very fair. So if you fall, it's your fault, not the game's fault. As you can see, it was my fault, not the game's fault. And this should be the last jump. Awesome game on the Commodore 64, so let's switch to the Amstrad. So, back with the Amstrad version. And for some reason, I got this uh, terrible flicker and uh, that means uh, that the game runs at 60 Hz. Don't ask me why. And this is horrible. Just horrible. <clears throat> Slow, boring, choppy. Controls are very bad. And yeah, let's let's hop to the end. Absolutely no sounds, no music in the entire game. And I'm dead and I'll stop playing this. This is horrible. 
So, let's uh, continue with the Amiga version. Okay, back with the Amiga version. And it's very colorful ah, and very hard. But you can learn from the computer since he uh, does not cheat. Ah. So if you uh, watch how the computer finishes the round, you you can see how it's how it's done. And I remember. This was one of the first halfway decent Amiga games. Most of the Amiga games from 1986, 7, 1986, 1987, 1988 were pretty terrible. But at least uh, this one had uh, some nice colors. And some good scrolling. <sighs> and this game is really hard. Oh, come on. And for some reason, you can accelerate while you're in the air. And I think you can also brake while in the air. Ah. But it's a fun game. I like it more on the Commodore 64, but... For a 1987, uh, 1987 game, it's, it's really good. Ah. How could I get this jump? Oh, what did I do wrong? And this game has uh, a level editor, so you can create your own, your own uh, courses. At least on the Commodore 64 and the Amiga, I'm, I'm not sure about the Amstrad. <laughs> I don't want to try out. It's horrible. So that was uh, Kickstart 2, pretty great game on the Commodore 64, definitely better than uh, Kickstart 1, uh, not as frustrating as Kickstart 1, uh, pretty nice on the Amiga if you consider that it's a uh, game from 1987 and totally crap on the Amstrad. So I hope you enjoyed this and thanks for watching.